So the Chancellor has made housing the grand finale of his speech, but it's something that will have only limited relevance to Northern Ireland. So house builders here will still face the uh, perpetual problems of funding, access to finance and planning permission to get through. So the Bank of Mum and Dad will still need to be rated uh, by first time buyers in Northern Ireland. The £300,000 relief is massively welcome, but really of limited benefit here given our lower average house prices. The Chancellor has today announced a review of both air passenger duty and VAT in relation to tourism in Northern Ireland. So massively welcome that we're going to see this issue addressed finally and from Northern Irish context. So air passenger duty will disproportionately affect Northern Ireland given that we have to fly everywhere for, um, for business and tourism. Um, so that's something that we want to see addressed in the short term and equally um, re potentially reducing the rate of VAT for tourism will help us compete much more with the Republic of Ireland who have a lower 9% rate today. So taking these things together, um, the right benefits for tourism in Northern Ireland would see us push ahead.